combo with Rivers of Catan. So you can see the rivers on here, um, over there, and then right down the middle. We just used the one desert, and we turned this desert into a gold mine. That worked very well. It was a four, um, but somebody used one of the cards to switch the numbers. So we just, we put it as a four. It was the best one to do. Um, worked really well as a combination. A couple things to note. Um, we did something different. So because there are coins involved, if there are more barbarians than there are knights, and you're about to lose one of your cities, you can actually pay five coin to stop that from happening. So that was actually a, um, a rule on the Catan website. So that was kind of neat. So we played that way and nobody used it. Uh, Ryder did end up losing a city, but he didn't buy his way out of it. He didn't have enough coin. It was better spent on resources. Uh, the diplomat cards. So the diplomat cards are the ones that take away roads from yourself or other players. They do not affect the bridges. As well, if you are removing a road from the river, you have to pay a coin to the bank. So again, that was a rule on the Catan, but nobody ever played the Diplomat card, so uh, we didn't have to deal with that one. We played victory points up to 14, and it ended up being about a 45 minute game. So actually a really quick game, we probably could have pushed the victory points up a little bit more. But we did go to 14, 45 minutes. No largest army, no development cards, Four to one base trade, so very basic game, and the initial placement is one settlement, one city. Um, yeah, and if you don't want to have this one as a gold mine, you can definitely have two deserts. But we went ahead and gave that one a four. We did not play with our twos and twelves. Instead, we had two, uh, we had three fours and three tens, and then we had two of everything else. So that's kind of how we set up the board. Um, it did come up, the question was asked, can I buy a commodity with coins? And our answer was no. Uh, you can buy a regular resource, of course, but we decided on no commodities being purchased with coins. And that's it. So we'll go into the placement here, and then you can see how it all played out. Combination cities and knights with Catan, or rivers of Catan. And that's it. Ryder rolled a six, so he's going to place first, so we'll show our placement order. Uh, with this combo, it's a settlement and a city, so Ryder will first place a settlement. And then Lily, then Mom. And then Mum will place her city, and then Lily, and then Ryder. And then Mum will place her two, no, sorry, and then Ryder will place his two roads, Lily and Mum. That is the placement setting for this game. Let's see who wins. <laughs>